this exhibition we show a typical model for kinetic group uh, consists of a tensibility structure with a light tensor on it. Uh, this is a prototype of the scheme we propose for the station design. Uh, I, I hope you have already seen this model in a book. If you not, please have a look. It is very amazing. And um, how it works is uh, it's made of a metal called biometal. So when the light sensor detects the light, uh, there is an uh, electricity lamp on the table. And the biometal constructs itself and it shrinks its length. So it through the structure and as a result, the structure deforming. Uh, this is a prototype of the scheme we designed for the competition to design the station. So here I'd like to talk about the architectural design behind this model. You can see the structure is following the movement of the light very simple. This is a design we originally proposed for the front station in Japan. Uh, to begin with this project, uh, we analyzed the activity which can happen in station or public transit. So what, essentially what we propose for this station is a public transit with a big county loop. So the activity on this public transit can happen anywhere and according to the environmental condition time to time and place by place. So we can classify the activity and relate them together and introduce a system like a screen system. So the like cafe wants to be a closer to the fireplace like a away from the car parking space. It's quite obvious it is a one to one a very complex in the complex system. So then we can expand it to the three dimensionally as a, a loop. So the loop is following the activity which is happening below the loop. So we introduce a three mode. One mode is a, a train user operation. And mode two, mode two is when there is a festival or a gathering. And mode three is the loop covering a discrete activity like a learning session. Where you can see the group of small uh, space and arising. The then after the assimilation of the computer, we moved on to a simple aspect of this uh, proposal. Then we found a change memory alloy for the biometal. Uh, it's uh, changing its length in response to a stimulation. So heat or electric current trigger the metal wire to contract or relax. So we use a sensibility structure so this can make most of this uh, material chromatic. And this molding can be activated uh, intentionally by introducing an electric current or it can happen sometimes naturally by a uh, function of the temperature changes. So in this way, the changing the modality of the environment are for the various activities. And even after the convention, we moved on to keep doing the design experiment to make sure it can be delivered. This is one of the studies we did. Uh, we introduced a potential method. It's a kind of switch which we can control the amount of electricity. You can see the LED light is printing on these buildings. This is because uh, the thickness of the structure, we can control it by amount of uh, voltage. Here you can see the, the amount of deformation of the structure is uh, according how we how much we the electricity. In some way, without electricity, the structure is quite flexible and sometimes it's soft. But when we put the mass voltage, the all the wire contracts and the structure becomes quite rigid. This is 